<laughs> All right, y'all. So I'm going to give everybody a few minutes to get in here. And um, while I'm giving everybody a few minutes to get in here, I'm going to be looking up some dimensions for y'all for these, excuse me, measurements. Ooh, that's, I should put thicker lotion on. Otherwise, I hope everybody is having a really good Saturday. Um, ooh, one of the things about being natural, child. Ooh, try not to mess up the do. All right. Okay. I hope everybody's having a wonderful and blessed day today. So far, so good. If you could, please hit the thumbs up button. I want to be on time, just like I said I would. So I am here on time. <laughs> yes, yeah, so let's see here. I'm trying to find dimensions for the Coach Dreamer shoulder bag. U.S. dimensions. <laughs> so we can get this thing started. Okay, so let's get it started. Hey, let's get it started in here. Ooh, ooh, in here. Ooh, ooh. Okay. One down. Okay. Right. All right, y'all. So everybody i'm mrs q and welcome to my youtube channel first of all i'd like to thank all my subscribers thank you thank you thank you for subscribing to my channel that means you like me you like me you really really like me and i like you too okay and if you like me and you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting on click on that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can get more of me mrs q and my silent co-host cj He's right there. Right there. What are you doing? Oh, he's eating a treat. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> he's eating a treat. All right, y'all. So, thank y'all for rejoining me. And I thought we would go ahead and get this thing started. Um, many of you have been wondering about this comparison. So, I thought, what better time to do one than today? I mean, you know. All right. So today we are going to be revealing my new. Go away. Dreamer shoulder bag. And I bought her. From the Coach Boutique at the Shops of La Cotera. Shout out to my sales associate, Gina. Hi, Gina. Love you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Gina's my fave. Okay. So. Of course, when it comes to Coach, we have this wonderful boxing. Okay. Now, some of you already know what this bag looks like. They have been popping up um, on the outlet website. They have been popping up at TJ Maxx. So, 
Yeah. But what I liked about this one was the craftsmanship of the bag. And, um, yeah. Okay. So this is the Dreamer shoulder bag in color block with whip stitching. Yeah, see, Gina knows me. She knows I like brand new factory packaging. I'm the first one to have touched her. I love her. All right, y'all. Like I said, y'all have seen this bag on my channel before. However, this is a different color. This is color block. Start taking some of this stuff off of here. Okay. All right. So we're gonna go over what makes her different from my other shoulder bag. Um, obviously the color, okay? She is color block. She has three different pinks. She has a a mauve, she has a light pink, and then she has a fuchsia gunmetal hardware. There's her hang tag on the side. That's her. She's ox blood, bottom leather, no feet. But I guess you can, this raised piece of leather, you can consider those her feet. That's the other side, okay? Look at that whip stitching. gorgeous i that remind me so much of the old dunia birthdays that i had to get this bag uh, she has a back pocket she has some whip stitching on along the back as you can see okay and she has two straps lordy b <laughs> All right, she has two straps. She has a leather strap and a chain strap, okay? So, let's see here. Okay. This is the leather strap. It is in ox blood. I know it's probably looking a little black, but it is ox blood, okay? So you have two strap options. This is strap option number one, the casual leather strap. And this is the infinity strap. And what makes it infinity is that it's not in two pieces. You can't unbuckle it and it be two pieces. It's one long strap. See, it curves under, okay? Somebody asked me that, so that's why I'm answering that. Okay. So I'm not pointing out obvious. Somebody might have asked me the question. That's what I do in my videos. I try to answer questions as well and show y'all some stuff. All right. So that's the ox blood strap. Yes. And then we have. Oh my gosh, this strap is beautiful. So you have two strap options. Now, most people probably will choose the chain, I mean, the, the leather strap over the chain strap. But the chain strap is really, it's not heavy. It's really light, okay? So five, three and a half. Um, you can adjust it right now. It is at the fourth hole, and you have one, two, four more holes for adjustment, okay? 
You also got holes on this side, but that's in case you want to, I guess, double the strap, um, you know, further to make it even shorter. Okay, so we're going to go with the long shoulder strap right now. Five, three and a half. This is her on my shoulder at the current setting. Move the table here so you can see, okay? This is her crossbody. All right? Now, what I meant about even shorter, if you want the leather strap to be shorter, this is where this comes in, the affinity strap. You simply unbuckle it. It's like a belt. And you pull it through. So, I'm going to pull it through on this side. So, y'all can see that you can make it even shorter. See that? Even shorter. And, of course, we can make it shorter than that. We have more holes over here, y'all. So this would be, I'm going to put it at the shortest setting, just so y'all can take a look. See here? Okay. Slide those down. And voila. Right? Shortest setting. And it's right above my hip. All right, now, that's the leather strap, okay? And some people were saying they didn't like the infinity strap. I don't know why. It's very easy to adjust, as you just saw. See how easy it was? Show was easier than my other strap. <laughs> was it i'm gonna put it on this original adjustment here all right and then it's back to the original adjustment well it's taking me so long as this plastic okay so now i want to demonstrate the chain strap that some people complain is too long and it might be too long for you. I'm not saying it's not long. It might be, okay? So, chain strap, same thing. This is her, just straight shoulder, okay? This is her crossbody. And if you want it shorter, the chain strap, we're talking about the chain strap, then you simply take one end, thread it through the loop, and connect it back to the other loop. There you have it. On my shoulder. You can also do it like that. Parker style. Okay. So, it's totally up to you how you want to wear it. If you don't want the chain strap at all, <laughs> you can take it off. It's too easy, y'all. You can simply remove it. I'm trying to find my scissors. I don't know what I did with them. Simply remove the chain strap all together. Right? If you want, you could attach a smaller strap. Or put your leather strap back on and adjust it. This oxblood is pretty with this pink. 
I really like it. All right. So there you have it. That is the Dreamer shoulder bag and color block. And this is like a pink color block. I agree the closet dive. They really should have done more colors with the cup, the whip stitch. I really like that. That's what made me buy this bag in the first place is the whip stitching. I mean, it's just so nice. You know? Then, of course, it has a back pocket. And um, we'll get on with the particulars right now. Okay. So, I'm going to sign into my Chromebook. And we're going to go ahead and go into the comparison portion of the video. All right. Now, I do know this one did go to the outlet. I'm on the outlet website now. And I'll be able to tell you if it's still available. Let's see here. Unfortunately, it is sold out on the outlet website, okay? However, they're both sold out on the outlet website. Wow, that was quick. I couldn't swim. Well, don't matter. All right, so let's get into measurements for both bags. So according to this, the Dreamer shoulder bag in color block with whip stitch. That would be the bag that I revealed. This is V5 True Pink Multi. And the style number on this bag is 76034. 76034 for the Dreamer shoulder bag color block with whip stitch multi. Okay. And according to Coach website, it is 10 and 1 fourth inches in length, 7 and a half inches in height, and 3 and a half inches in width. Okay. So. That's the measurements on this bag. Now, the Cassie camera bag. That's this one. This one's from the last video. You might recognize it. Um, the item number on it is, or shall we say, style number 638. And the color on this one is brass with confetti pink multi. Confetti pink multi, okay? That's the color name on here. And according to this, the measurements are nine and a half inches in length, six and one fourth inches in height, and two and three fourth inches in width. So according to this, the Dreamer shoulder bag is slightly longer in length because it is 10 and 1 fourth inches in length, whereas the Cassie camera bag is 9 and a half inches in length. Um, Height-wise, the Dreamer shoulder bag is slightly taller, according to this, 7 and a half inches in height, whereas the Cassie camera bag is 6 and 1 fourth inches in height. And... The Dreamer shoulder bag is slightly wider at three and a half inches in width and cast a camera bag two and three fourth inches in width. So now comes the fun part where we do the side by sides. Okay. Y'all ready? Let go. Okay. So here we go. And they're both sitting on my little table. So as you can see, Dreamer shoulder bag is taller. Hmm. Okay. Yep. It's taller. All right. Put it in. Put it in this strap here. So. Yep. It's taller. The strap is in the way. <laughs> okay. So. Turn to the side. Maybe y'all can see it better from the side. Let's do this. Put our camera down. There we go. 
Okay. All right. So, as you can see, Dream of Shoulder Bag, Cassie Camera Bag, there's the height. Let's see if y'all can see it better. Okay. All right. There's the height. Here's the width. Let's get this strap out of the way. There we go. There's your width. So you can kind of see it's slightly taller. Yeah. Okay. Nice size width though. Yeah. There it is on the side. Okay. So, yeah. Now, let's talk about functionality. It's because the way the camera is. Okay. See, there it is. See, there it is a little bit. There it is. Okay. So, functionality. Both bags have back slide pockets okay the camera bag has one strap whereas this one has two and they're both ox blood by the way um outside pocket this one has a true outside pocket with a turn lock closure and has a slide pocket this one does not. That's the Cassie camera bag. This one, Dream Shoulder Bag, does not. Okay? So, when you open each bag, this one has two compartments that have dual zipper closures. Okay? This one, Dream Shoulder Bag, is a magnetic snap closure. And the first snap is your, I call it the inside-outside pocket there. Right? Magnetic snap closure. Then you get to the true inside of this bag. And it has leather. Oh, that's so nice. Leather interior. Smooth leather interior. Okay. So on the inside of this one. Child. <laughs> trying to pull this stuff out so y'all can see. You have three sections. There's the dust bag. Okay. You have three sections. Back section, zipper pocket, front section. Okay. So that's the inside of that bag. Then in this bag, dual zipper closure. And again, brass hardware versus gun metal. Okay. This one, the back compartment only has a slide pocket. There's the dust bag right there. Then the front compartment is just a front compartment. No pockets or anything. Okay. So, basically... It just comes down to preference. What do you prefer? They're both. This one is more of a medium bag. Well, to me, they're both medium. This one's more medium than small, and this one's more small than medium. Okay? So, they're both medium bags. So, like I said, it just comes down to what your preference is um, as far as this bag. And... Looking at the colors, I don't know. I think it's this light pink. I'm not too particularly... It's cute, but I don't really have anything in that color. I'm leaning more toward these darker muted colors. Is what I'm liking more instead of these colors. They're pretty. They're just not for me, I don't think. Nah, I don't I don't think this one is is for me. 
but I, I like it. It's just that if I were to be going out the door, which bag would I reach for? It'll probably be this one because I have more in this color. That that pink is just a little bit too bright for me for some reason. I don't know what it is. I just like this one better. And I'm pretty sure it's because of this stitching and because of the height of the bag. And I, I, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. This one to me, I will agree, Sonya, feels more like Miss Parker to me. And that could be another reason why I like it better. <laughs> They're both pretty bags. But um, I think this one is more me. The colors on this one, um, that light pink, something about it is just, it's not me. But it's a nice bag. And it was a very nice price. Very, very nice price. So, yeah. So, fortunately, we won't be keeping this bag. Yeah, we won't be keeping this one. But it was a good price, though. I'll give it to a, I'll give it to y'all, Coach. It was a good price. So, yeah. All right. So we have made up my mind. The Dreamer shoulder bag, it is. She will stay. And the Coach Cassie camera bag, unfortunately, she will sashay away. Okay? So for those of y'all who are always wondering the difference between the two, there it is. All right, y'all. So let's see. Let's see Do we have any questions, any comments. Let's go back. Okay. Let me see here. Let's let's go backwards. Okay, so yeah. Hi LV Lux Girl. Hi Keisha M. Hi Ange Loves Dooney. It might hold more, but I think I still like this one better. I think it's still more me. Thanks, OG Cherie. She's loving the colors. Hi. Let's see. Thank you, Barbara Blake Bleaker, for liking the bags. I thank you. Hi, M Square Sissy. Hi. Closet Dive, my favorite day, but I think I spoke to you already. LV Lust Girl, hi. Loved your last video. Okay. Hi, Florentine Quack. Happy Saturday. Hi, sus, what? All right, y'all. So if there aren't any other questions... Yeah, we're going to go with this one. And, and it may be true. This one may hold more. And it may. And the only reason why I think it may hold more is because of the way the compartments are made. That's the reason why. Because if you look at this one, you have two separate compartments in here. This one's like a whole... You know what I'm saying? It's a whole compartment and it's split up. This one has two separates. So, yeah, it may hold more. I know it has more, for some people, may hold more functionality, especially with all these slide pockets. You got options of where to put your phone. You got three options of where to put your phone on this one. This one, you have one. You have two. You have to, yeah, do that. But I'm used to that now, especially after uh, carrying my Blanche. I am so used to those inside-outside pockets. That's what I call them. <laughs> I am so used to it, so yeah. But this is definitely the winner. And um, she, yeah, I'm either going to sell her or gift her, one of the two. So yeah. All right, y'all. I really do thank y'all for stopping by. I love both. I, I have to admit, because my tote one, um, I'm probably going to carry that one next Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah, next Wednesday. It's a light work day. So I was, I had planned my outfit already, you know, 
um, you, you, you know, I planned all this. <laughs> For real, for real, yeah. But, um, yeah. Thank y'all for stopping by. Um, I hope y'all have a wonderful and beautiful Saturday. Of course, we're going to see y'all tomorrow on Dunia at 615's channel. She's live at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for Feed Your Addiction. Um, I will be posting a way back wednesday video of my tabitha simmons and that's what it's called tabitha simmons crossbody bag with rivets that that's that's exactly what it's called <laughs> so thank you to whoever told me that last night and um it was one thing um about this bag that i truly love is that even though I don't have a back pocket, remember I told y'all that inside, outside pocket, that's what this is. Boom, my phone would go right there. And that's what I do. I just boom, get my phone out, close it. Boom, get my phone out, close it. And what I like about coaches, a lot of times, because of their different styles, you already probably have accessories that will match the bag, okay? Like, say, for instance, um... We gonna go over that. <laughs> we uh, we gonna go different video. We gonna save that for way back Wednesday, and um, that's gonna do it for this video. Thank y'all for coming. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It doesn't cost you anything, and it shows that you like this content. All right, all right. Thank y'all for joining me. See, I told y'all I was gonna do better with bringing y'all videos. Love y'all. Have a good day. Bye bye. See y'all tomorrow. <laughs>